By the gods, this is a good start. Where did these people set up their tent? <sighs> if there's nothing around the next bend, I'm turning around. Finally. Hey you, little girl. Giacomo Nauta sent me. I'm here about the riddle. Um, do you speak Goretti? I'm a friend. Giacomo told you I would come. He spoke of the hero of Andergast, a strong, courageous and clever man. Not someone I can slice open from head to foot in the blink of an eye. I am the hero of Andergast. Can you do magic? Heal things with fairy magic? The way the hero healed the dreams of an Andergastrian was magic? It wasn't quite like that, but yes, I can repair things magically. Then prove it. This before me is the flying fortress Kishari. I recreated it from my dreams. But no matter what I do, it keeps tipping over. Use your magic to make it stand up, and I'll let you see my father. Piece of cake. No magic necessary here. Hmm. Watch and learn. Learn that you have a big mouth? The fortress isn't broken, it's just badly made. Don't make excuses. Use your magic to make it stand up, and I'll let you see my father. What are you doing? Don't worry, I just want to try something. Oh! May I go in now? Papa, there's someone here claiming to be a hero. Send him in. If you truly are the hero, then you're a bit boring. You remind me more of a stupid, grumpy peasant. I'm a bird catcher, and I no longer care what others think of me. I rescued a fairy, and I freed a kingdom. I don't have to prove anything to anyone. All right, all right, go in. But watch your back, I'm right behind you. Ah, Geron, how nice. Come, sit. Sit! Are you Fahi? Yes, sit down. Did you find this place all right? Yeah, yeah. I was told that you sell a spell that can permanently change a person's form. A person's? Or an animal's? But everything in its time. Tea? All right. Ah, a man of taste. That's good. Andergast is cold, is it not? It's all right. But about that spell... Of course. You understand that permanent physical transformation is a formidable power. It demands a great deal of courage to request such power. I have my reasons. I know. Giacomo told me as much. You know my price. Giacomo said something about a riddle. Correct. You like riddles, Geron, don't you? As long as they can be solved. Don't worry. You'll carry it with you for a while, twist it and turn it in your mind, and perhaps even despair briefly. But when you finally solve it, the reward will be much sweeter. Where did you get this riddle anyway? For more than three moons, my daughter and I have both had the same dream every night. It's even more wondrous that this dream tells a true story, a memory from a time 450 years ago when our world faced its greatest battle. I will now tell you the beginning of the dream. You don't need to know more. And then the riddle. If you can solve it, you'll receive the power to restore your beloved. And if not? 
Garon. You are the hero of Andergast. Of course you'll solve it. So, are you ready? I'm ready. Good. The dream begins. As I said, 450 years ago, in an ancient vault far beneath my home city of Fazar, the powers of darkness threaten the land, and the great and decisive battle is imminent. When one night, a group of heroes enters the tomb of an ancient mogul mage, 